Hi all, this is a gate 1995 question. The number of elements in the power set of S. Okay, so the number of elements he is asking. So very simple. If you have any set, if you have any set, let's assume you have a set S such that number of elements in this set S is n. If the cardinality of S is n, then what will be the cardinality of power set? The cardinality of power set will be 2 power n. This is the standard result, the proof we have already seen in the class. Okay, so this is the idea because actually uh, in this set S you have total n elements when you are creating a subset then for every element of S we have two choices either you can take that element or you can or you, you can not take that element. Okay, so that's the reason I can say number of subsets of S that will be 2 power n and what is power set? Power set is basically set of subsets of uh, this S. So number of subsets is 2 power n. So this is the idea. Now you can notice what is the cardinality of set S here? Okay, in this you can clearly see that cardinality of set S that is basically 3. Because what are the elements of S in this set here? I can say what are the elements of S? So these are the elements of S you can notice. Okay, so elements of S I can say this is element of S, this is element of S and this is element of S. So total 3 elements of S we have. This is element, this is element, this is element. So number of elements of S, number of elements of S that is basically 3. Okay, so that's the idea. Now, if number of elements means cardinality of S is 3, then what will be the cardinality of power set? That will be 2 power 3 means that will be 8. So for this set, remember in this set, number of elements, this is element, this is another element, this is another element. Okay, so what will be the power set? The power set will be set of all subsets of S. So total how many subset will be there? So you can create subset. Remember this is element. Okay, this is this is element. This is element and also this is element. So these three are element. So I can say how many subsets you can create. So what you can do, you can remove all the elements. Then you will get this empty subset. Okay, so this empty subset you will get. Or, or what you can do, you can remove these two elements. Then this subset you will get. So okay, if you remove this element, this element, if you remove them, then this, is subs, this is subset you will get okay next similarly if you remove this element this element then this subset we will get similarly if you remove this element this element then then what we will get then we will get this subset okay similarly what you can do if you remove if you remove this element but you keep both of them then you will get this subset okay so this is another subset if you remove this element then what you will get then you will get this subset Okay, so this is another subset. Similarly, if you remove this element, then what you will get? Then you will get this subset. And if you keep all of them, then this S. So because the idea is every set is subset of itself. So S is subset of itself. And empty set is subset of every set. So you can notice empty set will definitely be present here. Because empty set is subset of every set. So empty set is subset of S. Also S is subset of S. So I can say S will be here. And similarly, these are the remaining subsets. So you can notice this is a subset of S, this is a subset of S, this is a subset of S, okay, this is a subset of S. So this is the idea. Here you need to note that if your set S is this, okay, so this is the set S. Now, few things you can note here is that if I ask you, can I say that this is a subset of S? Can I say this is a subset of S? No, this is not a subset of S. This is element of S. So you can notice this this is actually element of S. Okay. So because I told you what are the elements of S. This is element of S. This is element of S. So this is not a subset. So remember this is not a subset of S. This is element of S. What is a subset of S? I can say the subset of S will be this. This is a subset of S. Why? Why this is a subset of S? Remember this set is a subset of S. Why? Because every element in this set this is the element in this set every element in this set is also the element in s so this is the idea similarly if i ask you can i say 2 comma 3 okay can i say this is a subset of s is this subset of s no this is not correct because this is element of s remember again you can notice this is element of s you cannot this is element of s okay so what is subset of s i can say that this is a subset of s okay if i write like this now this is subset of s Okay, so actually this is the idea. So from here you can notice the power set has total 8 elements. So I can say cardinality of power set will be 8. Okay.